In the case of this painting, I use acrylic for the blocking. So when I start the water, I like to fine tune the shades, block in the entire area that I plan working on that day or the entire area of water uh, with a new base of oil, fine tune the shades. But I also like to do the details while that surface is wet. And it's because putting details over something that's already wet allows the uh, the ripples and everything that kind of blend into the surface. Uh, you could take a fan brush, stiff fan brush, and run that across the surface lightly. And you can move the wet paint around, giving you the effect of water. You can adjust it, you can shift it as far as you want. Now, you gotta be careful, but you can get the water effect there. Then the details are all the ripples. Uh, swirling in the water around the rocks everything else you do that with a liner brush for the most part Thanks for watching. See you next time.